Hey everybody, it's Lynn from A Bit of Birdsong. I thought I'd better check in for a few minutes and let you know that I'm still here. I have been very busy organizing the workshop. It's amazing. Everything is packed in here. I have my dehumidifiers. We're going to get an air conditioner for out here, so it's gonna be perfect. But I am working on a lot of custom orders and I'm just trying to put those together I hope that they will all be done soon. I go through everything when I put these together. So like right now, I'm looking at playing cards because I'm working on some different color packs. Um, blue, for example. Look at these beautiful cards. See, I love this blue. And uh, I think these are, let's see. Yeah, th these are so unusual. And they've got interesting images. Architecture. These are architecture cards. I mean, who knew? So I'm gonna pull out some of these for the blue packs. I have another container like this. It's out of arm's reach. I got this adorable postcard in the mail yesterday. It is so sweet. It's really funny. Romain Calm and Carrot On. That's by Bella Bug. And look at this. Look at all these beautiful stamps. The bee, the bird. That, that's cute. I like that little triangle with the bird on it. And then this sweet lady right here. She looks like a little gnome or a little elf. I don't know who this is from. I kept looking at this yesterday and trying to identify the handwriting because many of you, we've, we've sent things back and forth in the mail. So, I don't know. If one of you sent this, I love it. Thank you so much. It's going into my journal. It's a mystery. It's adorable. Look at the mushrooms. I still have Miss Hickory that I'm working in, and you see I have some loose things in here that I need to glue into place and some things I need to write about. This is my one of my garden journals. It's the Jane Davenport folder that I got, and I've got a couple of little traveler's notebooks in here to keep some notes about this year's gardening season. Uh, potted gardens, th these are just some magazines and books that I had out because I do work a lot from containers. And then I started a new garden journal. It's got um, pictures of things that I like. It has inspiration and ideas. Oh, I love that. I can't wait to get my hands on some really pretty containers for the garden. I didn't go out to the store yesterday. I know I talked about that. I just, I was really busy here and I'm still wanting to be really careful. I don't want to go out unless I'm really in the right mindset to go out and to be careful. Uh, May 1995, I had a one year old. It would have been exactly one year old because my third son was born in May of 94. Maybe I'll just flip and look at this while I'm talking to you for a minute. If you have emailed me and have not heard from me yet, I have been so busy and I'm not the best at keeping up with all the different social media platforms. There's Instagram and there's Twitter and there's Tumblr and there's Facebook, you know, personal Facebook and then the group Facebook and there's YouTube and I have about five different email accounts. So sometimes things, they, they slip, they slip down in my list of emails and I do get a lot of emails and I get sometimes you get people asking you if you wanna look at things and a lot of times it's stuff that doesn't tie in with what I'm working on. Look at that, I love that. That's really cool. And sometimes things scroll out of my sight, even those of you that I feel very close to. Some of you I've known for the duration of this channel, which is a couple of years. So if you don't hear from me, it is because I've been really, really busy on these custom orders and 
please know that it is not, it's not on purpose that I have not answered. Brandy, I love your website. And Karen, I've been thinking about you for days and I need to answer your last email. Uh, when I get quiet and start, like now, I, I start thinking about things. I haven't forgotten about the Halloween. I'm putting that stuff aside. I also have done a huge amount of color sorting. I've got four blue packs that are almost complete. I'm working on a yellow pack, some black and white packs, and whites and creams and black, and uh, what are the other colors? Green, green and pink. So just know, oh, that's pretty. So just know that I haven't forgotten about you, and if you've asked me something, or sent me something like Jennifer I just put your collage pieces in the mail and I'm working on the other pack I just wanted to say that I really appreciate everyone and I love all of the friendships oh goodness I love all these things so don't be afraid to to remind me, you know, you, you were going to do this, or I haven't heard from you, or oh, I remember all of this. So beautiful. I want some peonies, and I think the deer might actually leave those alone. Oh my goodness. That's the kind of stuff I had in my retail store. Old dresses. I constantly searched for vintage dresses with that sort of look. I had a lot of old bags. Um... In fact, I have a couple that are close by. I love this little bag. Oh my goodness. I did save a few. This is kind of a neat little, I don't know that this is really super old, but anything, anything that looked like this, that, that, that's what it was all about. I keep things close by, like uh, this sits on my desk. This was in my shop. It was just full of things that you had to just stop and look and look and look and look. Oh, look at that. So excited about gardening now. I wake up every morning thinking about my garden. The, the bunny was out there again. Uh, I noticed the first seed popping through the ground. And I'm really excited about doing collage lately. Oh, that's pretty. That's pretty. Okay, I'm going to stop. I just wanted to check in. I will be back later today with some packs for the shop. And thank you for being patient. It's because I'm working on so much at one time. So, anyway, thank you for that as well. I will see you soon. Bye for now.